dreaded 60 yard pitch shot over water. Why does it cause so many problems? Let me tell you what I think, why I think it's such a troublesome shot. Number one, you're trying to help the golf ball off the ground. It's a no-no, earth's in the way. Number two, you're scared. You don't want it to go in the water. You're trying to make it go onto the green or onto the fairway. So when we look at this shot here, everyone wants to make sure that it gets over the water. They don't want it to go in the water. So what are you thinking about? Water. Do you want to land it there? No. Stop thinking about it. Think about where you want to land it. So here's the big thing. If you're thinking about where you want to land it, stop using your most lofted club. Think about it from a sensible point of view. I've just hit 50 degree wedge. 50 degree wedge. 110 yard club on average for me. Now I've got 60 yards to go. That's 50 yards less. But what it does is it means I can put a controlled movement on it knowing that I've got enough club. So I don't have to worry. I can just let the club do all the work. So the key is, what do we need to do to set up? Narrowish stance, maybe about eight inches apart. Push down through your lead foot into the floor. Don't lean either back or forward. Just push into the ground here. That gives you a natural angle of attack into the golf ball. Shaft, from my angle, look straight up from your angle. It's got a bit of forward lean. We don't need loads. We just want a little bit. Why? Because we want to use this bit. We want the sole of the club to ride the ground not the leading edge, to dig it up. From that point, it's all about the movement. Your arms move the club back. Your chest turns the arms and the club through. The body keeps the pressure on the lead side. It really is that simple. So what are the mistakes that you make to make it so difficult? We lean back this way. We try to scoop it and get the club head underneath the golf ball can't happen. So we chunk it, we thin it into the water, across the green. Ring a bell. All we've got to do now is commit to the shot 100%. See? Commitment. So follow those steps, keep it simple, don't try and help it up, don't try and scoop it, don't think about the water. Think about where you want to land it, select enough club and commit to it and that's it you do that you're gonna have more success it's a guarantee thanks for watching thumbs up subscribe comment share that's all i'm asking see you next time